This is Movie Turn. Leslie Mitchell reporting. The third largest bridge in Europe will carry the London South Wales motorway over the River Severn. It's one of the main showpieces of Britain's road programme and Minister of Transport Barbara Castle was there to have a look at it. Work is well ahead of schedule. In fact, the Queen is due to open it early in September, five months earlier than expected. Once it's open, it'll mean the end of the Aust Ferry that crosses to the Beachley Peninsula, eight miles upstream from Avonmouth. The bridge is a mile long and provides two carriageways, each 24 feet wide. If you like statistics, the steel towers supporting the cables are 400 feet high. The cables themselves have been spun from 18,000 miles of wire. As for the rest of Britain's road programme, Mrs Castle said that in spite of cuts of 14 million pounds, the schemes already announced would be carried through. Within a few days of exhorting us to save the sinking pound, the Prime Minister was at number 10, not Downing Street, but Matthew Street in Liverpool. Bessie Braddock had invited him to reopen the famous Cavern Club where the Mersey Beat all began. No truth in the rumour that Harold was hoping to nationalise it. Some may think it's an odd place to find him at such a critical time, but as he said to the ambassador for Naughty Ash, the fact that we have a job to do to put this country on a strong foundation is no reason why we shouldn't enjoy ourselves. Wilson may be called.